um, it is a blessing for you to be watching this YouTube today. This video is going to be a very informative one. So maybe this is the first time you are seeing my face on a YouTube. Do not scroll away. Just watch to the end and it may help you. If not even you, it may help another person. Because this is a new YouTube video that I'm making. And then it's going to help us elevate our life. The main purpose of these videos I'll be making from today onwards is to help other people who are in search of information. People who want to work abroad, people who want to study abroad, but they don't get any information. They are stuck. I'm here to help you in my best possible way. My name is Joshua. And I hope my videos are going to transform you. A little bit about me. Recently, I'm in Canada. I used to live in the United States. I moved from Ghana to the United States in 2017. So I hope being about five years in the United States and now in Canada, um, I can tell you some of the things that you need to know if you want to come to abroad to study, if you want to come to abroad to work, or even if you want to work in your home country. Want to work in your home country. So I will encourage you to stay with me. Let us stick together. Let us share our thoughts on most of the issues bordering our life, the hurdles in our life. And I hope um, by watching my videos, some of the hurdles could be lifted. And then you'll be free. Some people only need just one minute information and then they'll be okay in life. So even if this video is not for you, it doesn't concern you, watch it. It might concern somebody you know. So whatever you are watching, make sure you tell others. Make sure you let other people know. Because I know the hardship a lot of people are going through and then they need somebody to come into their aid to elevate them. So the purpose of today's video would be why do you want to move abroad? Why do you want to move abroad? I know a lot of people want to move abroad. Like they said, well, if they should bring a plane to your country's airport, international airport, and say, well, the doors are open. Anybody who wants to come to America, who wants to go to Ghana, who wants to go to Dubai, who wants to go to China, Australia, just come on board. Everybody will pack their little belonging and move straight to the airport. It is very true. And it is possible you can also come to abroad with the little information I share with you. It's difficult, but it's not hard. You can do it because I did it. Others did it. So you can also do it. But you need somebody to lead you. I see a lot of videos out there that people talk of a whole lot of things. Yes. They are all true, but not all of them will help you. I'm not saying mine is going to help you, but I'm saying I'm only giving you the information. So now let's look at this this way. 
know your purpose. The first thing you have to know is know your purpose. Don't just wake up one day and say, because my home country, there is hardship day, economic crisis, so I want to move abroad. Why do you want to move abroad? That should be the first thing you should be dreaming of. Why? Is it that you want to move abroad to study? Is it that you want to move abroad to work and live there? Or you just want to come and then visit, see some of the luxurious things around, enjoy yourself? You should know your purpose. That is very, very important. So one thing I would tell everybody watching this video is anytime you come to my video to watch, get a pen and a paper and write some of the important things you need down for yourself. So today is just going to be a general overview of some of the few things that you need to know. The first thing is know your purpose. So know the purpose you want to move abroad. Is it for study? Is it for work? Or is it for tourism? The next thing you should know is you have to read, read. Now, even not only read, read and watch. There are tons of YouTube videos. There are tons of information out there on the internet. Like many people have um, smartphone, they buy data on it every day, every week, they spend money on it just to go to Facebook, just to go to TikTok, to watch what other people are doing, what other people are doing. But it shouldn't be, it should not be only that. You should use that data, that phone, to read Things that will inform you on your purpose, on what you want to do. So you could watch a lot of YouTube video on studying abroad, on work, and then life in abroad. You should do that. So that is very, very important too. Then one more thing. I should have said that first. Like I had a friend who one day asked me, well, can you help me come to the United States? I said, well, um, I don't work at the United States Embassy, but I can give you information on any possible way you could get to the United States. I can give you all that information. So my first question to my friend was, okay, is your passport ready? I said, no, I don't have a passport. But it's like, you want to come to the United States, but you don't have a passport, and I, I should help you come to the United States. How? So if it's, it is your dream to travel outside your home country, then the first step is get a passport. Get a passport. That is the first thing you should get. Get a passport. It's very important that you get a passport. If you don't have any dream of traveling, then passport is not important to you. But if you have the dream to travel outside your home country one day, get a passport. I know in some countries, you can go without a passport from your home country. But I think... Those are not the country you are dreaming of going to. And then one thing which might be important to many, but it's not necessary, but it's very important, is to get a driving license because it helps a lot if you travel outside your country to a different country with a valid driver's license. It helps a lot. So if you know you don't have a passport, that should be on your list to get a passport. If you plan to travel outside your country, 
being it to go and study, being it to live there, because um, that is the only way you can travel outside that country if you want to come to America, Canada, Europe, or any of those countries you are dreaming of, you need to get a passport. And then one thing you should also know is don't be in hurry to pay money to agents. Do not be in hurry to pay money to agents because all the information those agents could give you, you can also find them on the internet. You can find them on the internet. You can get all those information on YouTube. I use the word, don't be in hurry to pay to agents. At times, you may be, you have a whole lot doing, so you don't have time to do some of the paperwork because um, it is tedious, it takes time. So you have to pay somebody to do that for you. That is fine. But don't just say, Hey, have this money or agents are saying, bring this money. Let me help you go abroad. Be careful with that. Be very, very careful with that. And then ask questions. Ask yourself questions. Anytime you are researching into information, if you watch any video and then you have something to ask, ask. After watching my videos, if you need anything, you need to ask me. And then I will explain. And then every information you hear, especially from videos, like whatever I'm telling you, you have to do your own research on that. Because if I tell you, well, you could go to this school, they have free scholarship. You have to also take your phone, take your computer, Google that school, and find out if the information I gave you is 100% accurate. You know, and then information keep changing too. Information keep changing too. So you have to also do your own research on the questions you ask, the answers you receive, the video you watch, the information you get, do your own research on them too. It's very, very important important then you need to plan very very well so this channel is going to be all about living abroad studying abroad working abroad working in your home country things to do for you to succeed in your education how to plan your money how to manage like it's about life, how to lift our life up, how to lift our life up. But one thing I've learned is in Africa, in Ghana specifically, you need a huge amount to start something up. There's no doubt about that. If you check all those who have made it, they got something, a huge amount from somewhere. You can start from the scratch, but it will take a longer time. That is why I will encourage everybody who have the chance, the capability to travel abroad, travel, get the amounts you need over there, work hard, and then you can use it to set up something in Ghana or in any of the African countries. Yes, that is the truth I know. That is the truth I know. So it's very, very important. I'm not going to talk for long for today because um, I'll try my best to put out a lot of the information outside there on the YouTube. So I will encourage you to subscribe to this channel, share it to your friends, tell your friends we are here to build a solid family to help one another with information needed. To help one another with information needed. That is very, very important.
here. The channel is not to give you money. Yeah, so don't don't call or message me and say I need money. No, that is not the purpose of this channel. It's to give you information, to tell you what you could do, to tell you the opportunities outside here that you can also tap into. I know some people might ask, oh, give me money, give me money. No, that is not why I'm doing this. So we'll be looking at some things like schooling abroad, living abroad, working abroad, working in your home country, um, making money. There are so many things we can do to make money. This time, we are not looking at that. I'm not looking at that. So I will end this video here. Um, let me hear from you. Let me hear from you some of the things you want us to talk about. And then if possibly, let me hear from you where you are watching this video from. Which country are you watching it from? Let me hear from you. And then the most important thing is for you to subscribe if you get hold of this video. This is a new channel, so we need to grow it so that... Um, YouTube would send it wild for many people to get access to this information. I'm here to give you pure and raw information. Very pure information. So you have to tap into it and see which one will resonate with you. Which one is going to help you in your journey. And I'm here to assist you any way possible. I'm using any way possible some people think um, if you say you are here to assist them, then 100% uh, they should get to their dream. No, I will tell you what I know who help you. Then you have to decide on what you need to do. I will tell you every possible things that I know. The good, the bad, the ugly, the hard part in it. And then I will tell you traveling abroad is not easy. It takes a lot of time, it takes a lot of energy, it takes a lot of resources. Take a lot of time, energy and resources. So it's not just watching the video, writing things down and not acting on it. Get started, act on whatever you, you hear from me. And then if you are very serious, within a year or less, if you want to school abroad, it should be day schooling. If you want to live and work in abroad, if you have the qualification, it should be there. So let's team up and let's do this together. Don't forget to subscribe, tell your friend to tell a friend, and let's all subscribe and join this together. See you next time with another good topic, I will let you know next time. Bye.